friends here tonight, buddy. They're always here. I mean, I mean, well, you know, I don't know. Traffic. Yeah. Scoping. Hey, Mark. How are you? I'm like, I'm, I, oh, good. We still always miss you. Hey, um, the, um, I haven't, I, well, stop by. I, I haven't seen you since the big court event where we, we got rid of that nonsense out there. <laughs> yeah. This time I'll call a meeting order if we stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, liberty, and justice for all. I got one thing to say, two things to say before I start the meeting. Uh, John Planchar, you come to these meetings uh, constantly saying that uh, we're violating your First Amendment, your Fourteenth Amendment. You sure know your Constitution and the stuff, but you, you refuse to stand for the pledge of this flag. And a lot of good people came home with a coffin, with a, with a flag over their coffin to give you the right to act the way you're acting. Number one, I'm speaking as a veteran. That's number right. two, thank you, thank you for giving me that right. Thank you number for two, your ass on the line number two, right. you're not allowed to record us unless you're in the back of that room. Video recording. It's back there. Is it back there? It's back there. Okay. <laughs> Who else? Has, Dave, you have a camera on? Body you, cam. Yeah. You have to be at the back of the room. I do. Yes. Is that a video recording? Absolutely. Then you have to go back to the back. Video area, right in the back. You want to sit in the back of your camera? Yeah, thank you. Thanks, Jack. Okay. Thank you, Dave. I don't answer questions. Thank you. Okay. I don't answer questions. Approval of the agenda. Approval of the minutes of regular meeting of January. Are you videoing on your chat? Is that is that a body camera on the chat? Is it on? If that is a video camera, go to the back room or you'll be will be removed from this meeting. I'm asking nice, one time. Okay, John, remove him from the meeting. I'm not dealing with this crap moving out the meeting. Do it the way it are, but. I'm sorry. It's okay. He was removed. He's not allowed to say anything. Hold on, grab that person. I got your jacket. Don't touch my shit. Don't touch my stuff. It's not yours. Give you my jacket right now. Drop it. Drop my jacket. It's not yours. Okay, approval of the minutes of the regular meeting of January 18th. Motion approved. Second. Probably moving second all in favor. Aye. Aye. Opposed? Uh, person requesting to be on the agenda, Dave Hill. Yes, sir. Three minutes, Dave. Thank you. Thank you. Listen, first of all, I <coughs> thank you and Bob and Kyle for your professional work and class running the township along with Roy and Bill. The people are well served. I'm happy to announce that I will also be running for supervisor. I've had enough. Okay. I'm not going to replace anybody, none of you guys. I'm going to replace him based upon his conduct and his misconduct and everything else. When I call for a cop, it's going to happen. October 18th, Mr. Pioli stated specifically, if you my Camry County dispatch calls, I never request an officer. I ask you, out of your mouth. <coughs> that statement is a total lie to everyone in this room. This representation and slingers, all to myself. That statement also a felony. That is fired with John Blake to pay two false and peace reports, which are legal and self-serving scheme. My requisite account my act of records in the country, which will be in, under discovery this future. So, you, you go with that. I'm interviewing federal civil rights attorneys, including Todd Hollis. I'll be represented soon. It's going to be over. But not for you and not for the You guys are my heroes. That stuff won't fly in my world. I've had enough. Um, you, you had a chance to admit to this. You had false documents. He said he created documents on I mean, he had documents on 95, 921, um, and I actually contacted the FBI in Pittsburgh. 
and they want to talk to me about what went on. It's beyond my freedom of conscience. All the constitutional rights belong there. I also want to state publicly, John Blake made my information through all databases he had access to, <coughs> which is illegal in Pennsylvania and federally. I already know that. You can't get out of it. That's, that's beyond a statement. That's that material fact. And I'm going to apply for police commitment once again on the township supervisors. And I'm sure you guys are going to be a commission. The time for somebody to be in charge of the police, not have you as a trainee boy doing tricks and fetching and everything, I'm done. I'm just so angry with this whole thing. It should have never happen. Then I got an attorney who knows better stopping me from speaking. So where you represented? I'm almost represented. I'll tell you when I am. But enough of this. Is, is, the illegal conduct is not going to go. It's not going to go unnoticed. The switch is done. These, everything I said, my wife's safety and my safety are not a joke. You thought it was funny. Blake thought it was funny. I still don't understand funny. When I see your grandson almost get killed. I'm going to drive. Right. Don't no, 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 stop. Stop. involved. Grandson Shut up. involved in this. Don't interrupt me, you clown. Shut your mouth. I'm, don't I'm, you I'm tired of you getting my I'm tired of you, you piece this. of crap. Shut up, Paul. You're done. Three minutes up. Three minutes is up. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, Shanna, Sasko? Sasko, Murphy Sasko. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> All right, and I realized. Oh, oh, Shanna, that's it, right? It's my business card. I think it's like one. Um, okay. He's about to get it done here. All right, I'm going to try to get all this together quick because I realize that I don't have a lot of time. So I have some information for each of you guys about comprehensive planning which is what I came to speak to you guys all about, is, um, I don't know, paper clips for this one. We were recently, I'm from the Cambria County Planning Commission, by the way. I'm sorry, I don't really do well when I'm on a timer, but that's okay. So I'm going to also start this by saying, I would really like to meet with you guys at a smaller, you know, setting too, so we can talk more if you guys would be interested in proceeding with this. but. About six months ago, we were approached by the South Montboro Council to, they want to do a comprehensive plan. And to use um, the type of funding that would probably be the best to be used, it's called the Municipal Assistance Program, and that program is they would really, for the state to fund that, they really prefer to have a like, multi-municipal effort, so it'll make for a more, you know, competitive application, you know, it would have some cost savings because there would be more than one municipality going in on it. So we wanted to go with the rest of the West Hills to see if any of the other municipalities who neighbor Southmont would be interested in joining in this effort to do a regional comprehensive plan on a multi-municipal level. I spoke with West Montboro on Tuesday. They are receptive to it. They want to find out more. I also plan on speaking to Lower Yoder Township in Brownstown Borough, hoping that maybe they will you guys all, you know, share some lines with the border and, you know, a lot of common initiatives. So we would be overseeing that as the Cambria County Planning Commission, so it wouldn't be just a Southmont plan or just an Upper Yoder plan. It would be overseen by me and my and a colleague, and we would be who would go for the funding and everything. So I'm really hoping that you know, you guys would like to continue this conversation at some point, and you all have my business card, so okay. hopefully you guys can give me a call or an email if you guys want to talk again. Thank you, Thank you right. very much. Thank, Thank you for having me. I'm sorry that I don't do well on oh, a short timer like that. Thank you. you did very good. Thank you. Uh, anybody under public participation? If not, at this time, we're going to enter an executive session. We will return. Right, Wayne? Yeah. 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 Which is good because that's 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 very fun. Yeah, I'm gonna stand back here for that.
in the chair. You don't have to stand there. You can see I can keep my wife from there in order for 20 minutes. <laughs> well, you've been married a long time. I can tell. 30 years. Okay, approval of the board secretary payroll income. Can I make a motion? Second. I move and second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Approval of general fund bill for the total amount of $63,783.95. Oh, second. 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 All in favor? Aye. 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 Please roll call. Paul? Aye. Sue? Aye. Ed? Aye. Cal? Aye. Bob? Aye. Approval of other fund expenditures in the total amount of $117,154.84. Motion. Second. 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 All in favor? Aye. 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 Please roll call. Bob? Aye. Cal? Aye. Ed? Aye. Sue? Aye. Paul? Aye. Okay, moving on. Uh, unfinished business engineer's report. So, Recreational Resource submitted their certified payrolls. Uh, we've reviewed them, everything's good. Uh, so, the only thing we have is we're going to request a motion to pay their final invoice to Recreational Resource. Uh, it's in the amount of $89,012. I'll make a motion. I'll second. Right, move and second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Okay. Is that all? Yes, that's all. Thank you. Uh, we're going to have a table. Please do the telephone computer system upgrade. Uh, yeah, I'm going to make a motion on the telephone system. Um, Floral Net Services had submitted a bid uh, that we go with option one, uh, upgrade our current phone systems and add additional phone as needed. $1,400 with a monthly charge of 200 servicing it. So, Can I move? Yes. I'll second. Court move second. All in favor? Aye. Opposed? On the computer systems upgrade, we're going to table that for right now. Thank you, Tom. Okay, uh, moving on. Dave, you have anything? Yeah. Bob? No. Kyle? Um, now, I do want to add that uh, a few of us did a 10 day Pennsylvania State. Association of Township uh, seminar here a few weeks ago and uh, learned a lot and uh, appreciate the opportunity to do that and hopefully a lot of light will be learned there uh, in, you know, into effect here and uh, moving forward. But I uh, again thank everybody for that opportunity to attend that. So thank you. Yes. Thank you. I have nothing to say. I have a couple things. One, um, we talked about the rate on test kits that are available from the American Lung Association within the next two weeks. They told us they would arrive. There'll be 10 of them, and they'll do them in groups of 10. They'll be available to residents of um, Upper Yoder Township. Please watch the website, and the website will provide information on how you can get those. Um, I'd like to also move that we amend our zoning ordinance to add solar farm uh, a solar farm ordinance to include regulation, construction, operation, and decommissioning. I'll second. For a move and second, all in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? That's it. Thank you. Paul? Um, I think I'll say one thing. Um, can we um, make a motion that we get um, quotes to re um, replace the front sidewalk since the weather's dry? I am glad to. Give it to me in the spring. Okay. We get really, it's already on the burner, so. so I, I will call him probably in March and, and look up at him now. That's it. Uh, Gary, did you have anything, John? No. Uh, John Blake gave us our report. Do you have anything else, John? Nothing else. <clears throat> Other correspondence, uh, Dave Hill certified letter, February 1st. Any comment on that? The new business 2024 spring fall election use of facility at 110 Sunray. I'll make the motion that they use the facility collection. I'll move the second all in favor. Aye. Aye. Opposed? Banking. No, no, no. 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 <coughs> Sylvania, uh, the garbage fund for the Sylvania, and I move that we 
enter into two CDs, one a seven month and one a 13 month, and use the funds for that to increase and help with income. So it would be, I just make a motion that we um, purchase two CDs at the Sylvanian savings. One will be a seven month and one will be a 13 month. Those are 5%. One's five and one is four point six. Six, yeah. Um, one is five point one two five percent, and the other is four point six seven eight percent. They'll be due September of twenty twenty four and March of twenty twenty five. What are the amounts? Fifty uh, fifty thousand for each. I move that. So motion's in. Yes. I'll second it. Second all in favor. Aye. 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 Is that all? Yes. Uh, payment of Westmont Hilltop Recreation Commission Central. I'd like to make a motion that we pay our portion of twenty-five thousand six hundred. I second that. Court second. All in favor? Aye. Opposed? Spring 2024 road inspection. I think we're at the end of March. Uh, Any times? Good for me. Uh, you driving, Paul? full-time police officer Autumn Castor. for redoing the playground in the Elam section uh, and also putting the walking track in. The walking track and the pickleball courts are being utilized. I live on Van Tell when I get down there. Anytime there's nice weather, there's waiting lines to pickleball courts. And uh, everybody is using, utilizing the track around the, the field here. So that's really nice. I'd like to thank them for doing that. Thank you, Dan. Thank you, Dan. Okay, anybody else? Other public participation? I need a motion. Hey, for oh. One thing that we missed. On the secretary's report, the Humane Society, they oh, returned yeah. our check. Yeah, they're not taking dogs anymore. They aren't taking dogs anymore. Um, the oh, police yeah. departments, can you explain a little bit, Chief? Uh, Chief Polino at Stony Creek Township's in the process of starting up a service uh, through the township. Um, as soon as he gets more details and gets it, uh, approval, He's going to be reaching out to all the other surrounding areas to see if we want to be able to join in. And it would actually be more cost effective than what the Humane Society contract was. I think he's done that already. He's sent he's out to some other They place. met the other night. I haven't spoken to him, so I don't know where he's at right now. Okay. Okay. Thanks, John. Uh, <clears throat> anything else? Um, there's a, a letter from Victim Services um, thanking John Blake for his service to the public and um, Heritage Ridge sent a little note here thanking uh, Officer McCann and Chief Blake for finding one of their residents. I just want to acknowledge that. Acknowledge that. Okay. Did we miss anything else? I don't think. Can you send a report to the animal? Allison? 
say we miss it on a target report? I don't think so. Okay, if not, uh, I need a motion to adjourn. I make a motion. I'll second. Pardon me, a second. second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Install. Are you guys Wonderful. Yeah. Yeah, you. Hey, I'll watch. Wow. 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 He was a chief here probably about 12 years ago. They were getting ready to fire him for all kinds of misconduct, so he retired. He lives down the end of Bantel Street by Palm there. But yeah, he, they were, he's the one who, what's his name, killed his wife and burned in Elam or something, shot her and then burned the house. He got the state police all mad and they walked away and said, we're not doing it. They never got to, it was his, it was his husband that did it, but they never got him. But yeah, he was another clown. <laughs> I came in here saying I'm only here because my boss got a DUI or something. I was like, I don't even know anything about that. So. Thank God you were here. This was a this was a good one. I guarantee you. <laughs> yeah. I mean, John pushes the envelope. I mean, he really does. Okay. But we went to see one attorney, and I said, I'm the good witch. He's the bad witch. But the issue is the same. And Blake makes up two false police reports. Um, you guys, you said you mentioned something at some point. You want a, a interview from me or something like that, or something? Is, or Eric, find out from Eric what he wants. Yeah, yeah, I'll talk to Eric about it. We'll just see what yeah. they want to do. But um, please, I'm gonna see. I'm gonna try and grab one of them. I'm gonna get it their side of it, and then yeah, I have yeah. all your stuff. We have all your stuff and everything like that. All your papers. Um, yeah. Oh, that's fine. No, I like everything up front. I gotta go yell at Ed. I'll be right. Back. I want to thank you for putting up with me. I got, listen, he started laughing. I lost it. No problem. You too. Well, excuse me, sir. Oh, yeah. What's that? Oh, I know that. I know that. You know, I mean, you know my issues. You know how hard we work at the board. Oh, absolutely. Well, you guys, I said, oops, I said that. You guys, absolutely. But what happened to me was wrong. And you guys got my leg. You know what happened. Thank you. We'll see you. Hey, you done? done. Hey, I, I don't want to cut you off. Oh, no, 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 that's okay. I gotta have I gotta have Ed yell at me first. What's that? You're not leaving without yelling at me. I know. You're not leaving without yelling at me. You know what? You're just as nice as your father. Thanks for putting up with me. Yeah, yeah I'll talk to you. All right. I'm not yelling at you. No, I know that. I'm just kidding. I'm trying to Ed. I'm trying to be like you when I grow up. Yeah, you don't want to be like me. Good <laughs> he started laughing. That sends me into orbit. Well, you know. Huh? You can. I'll, I'll talk to you later. Yeah. I don't care. <laughs> Good. Oh, wait, I don't want to record you. I'm sorry. I'm around. No, you ain't going nowhere. You here? Because this township will fall apart, huh? I'm Yeah, you, this township's gonna fall apart without you. Oh well, I didn't get to her. I had another speech, but I, I didn't. I didn't want to do it. Yeah. I didn't want to do it. I'm like, no, no. I, you know what? Yeah. You, you get it. I'll talk. To, I'll talk. To All right. Be good. Yeah. Good Stay out of trouble. Hey, you bought the fancy truck out tonight, huh? huh? You bought the fancy. No, truck? That's my middle truck. Oh my middle. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> I have a new one. I have a thought new one. It's an 08. Yeah. It only has 2,400 miles since my garage. A red F250. Right. That's my toy. Yeah. Well, you better make sure they don't break into your garage or something. You know, your odor is like. <laughs> yeah, I'm not worried about it. <laughs> no, I know. I'll, I'll, I'll take care of it. <laughs> <Yeah. myself. laughs> hey, I'll talk to you later. Thanks. All right, be good. See ya. Bad boy, bad boy.
What's that? How's the knee? It's still killing me. Is it? So is mine. <laughs> I'm so, I'm I, sorry, I know. No, no, no. Listen, don't worry about it. I, I knew you weren't trying to beat the shit out of me. He's, he's tough, though, man. He smacked the shit know, out of me. I was embarrassed. You're trying to be like me when you grow up? I'm 73, almost 73. You know, you shouldn't do that to your senior. No, it was funny. And nothing against you guys. What went on is just between me and a couple of people in here. And it was wrong. But, hey, I'll get it straight now. Ed, Ed told me to calm down. Yeah, I, you know what? I, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna say that you know, Blake is a very good guy. He's a, he, he's, he, I don't know. Look, it's, now I seen, I seen the meeting that you, that you were at last time. You, you, you quoted Wally Howell. I worked for Wally Howell. Listen, Wally Howell was a wonderful man. I know Wally for man. how many years? Yes. I knew his father. Yeah. Um, uh -huh. But Wally would stop by the house, and we just one day he's there an hour and a half. He says, "Dave, I gotta go." He says, "Nobody's gonna know I'm out here anymore." And that's the way he was. I mean, real guys stop by. But it's like, but, you know, they yeah. don't, well, like him, but. What's that? Nothing. I was talking about I don't, you. Get out of here. Good. Good. Yeah. No. The um, times have changed, though. I mean, well, things, I mean, from the, from the era that, you know, yeah. Wally, Wally was chief, you know, things, things weren't like they were today. Well, you know, things are a little bit more. Like, I, I gotta just tell you something, okay? I knew behind the scenes, okay? But that, that lady is still flying up and down Meadow. The thing is, that's why I bought this. It ain't from here. She goes by my wife and I at 60, 70 miles an hour. She don't care, okay? Now, I know it's one of his special friends, but that don't fly with me, okay? okay. That part I don't Well, no, no, you, you wouldn't. And I'm not going to put you guys in the middle of it because I don't do that. I mean, if I told you what my career was, and I said to him on that September meeting, I, my career, I was in Connecticut. I got cops fired for that stuff. One guy, one state cop threatened me. Guess where he didn't work? And I got a Hartford cop fired for burning his car. I said, you got a choice. I'm going to bring it to state police or you're going down. Well, the internal affairs guy, he was not Neil Drive. He came to my house and then he, not chief of Cheshire, Connecticut, but he, um, he just said, Dave, show me, what, show me how you did this. He said, I've never seen anybody do stuff like this. So I gave him all my files and everything. They yanked the guy. But you know what happens up there, after three years, he actually got his job back, but he didn't get paid. <laughs> it's funny. But I told him, I said, you got a choice. And I'm honest, I don't lie to people. You got a choice. Either you withdraw the claim or you're dead. And he goes, no, I, I, I get it. I've dealt with, you know, my career, I could walk into half the police departments in Connecticut, okay? They love me. State police, two guys that work with me, retired state. I go in there and I say it like me more than you because you were in freaking internal affairs. They hate your ass, but they love me. <laughs> I didn't do that to them. <laughs> but anyhow, life goes on. If you're around, stop by. I'll show you my car collection. What house? What, what house is yours? The house on Meadow with the maroon roofs. It's got two garages in the back. Uh, down, down at the bottom, we go past Shady Oak. Like we we'll go down past Kelps. Shady Oak. We'll be on your right. And Kelps, sorry, where the right Kelps. next to Tyler. Go into the house below Tyler. The big garage on the next guy down. Okay, I know right. You know Tyler, right? Yes. Yeah, nicest guy in the world. It's like, but yeah, he's got a garage full of stuff too. Well, yeah, when Nick came out to the house after I screened of Blake that meeting, Nick came out. What? I love okay. Nick. He came out and he uh -huh. had a conversation. And, I thought it calmed down for a little bit, but it just it just got out of hand again. That's right, Susan. But hey, I'll draw over because I, I don't have my car. But on. that's it. But and nothing, against, nothing against you guys. I mean, I, 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 we'll take it that way. Just, I, 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 you know, I, 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 I just, I've been here for a long time. No, no. I, how so, long have you been? You know, for me? How long have you been in, up here? Off and on. I, I've been an officer for 32 years. Um, off and on, I've been with the township probably going on like 20 years. Mm -hmm. um, so I, I've been, Krasik was, was the chief. One. Yeah, I, I well, knew, no, no. my buddy lived across the street from my new Dan way back in the okay. day, yeah. Yeah, so no, it was um, Ed Kleitz. He, he, he hired me. Yeah, okay, that goes way back. That goes way back, yes. That goes way back, yeah. yeah. So I've been through uh, a lot of chiefs. Well, you know, you, you got to, we got to get along somehow. You know, oh, no, no, I, I get these, that. These, this whole department, you know, we, that's oh, what I'm saying. When I call. The, the department that we have now, you know, I, we, all, we're, we all get along really I, well. I believe you. Listen, I'm not, I'm not after that. My deal was, I called, I said, I want somebody here. It's got to stop. Two feet from me. Okay, she did it to us twice. My girlfriend's up the street. You know what a Stonehenge uh, yard is um, up at the top of the hill? Yeah. By, by where Mark Walker used to live. Anyhow, um, Georgia, she's my 78-year-old girlfriend. 
So we're standing there. We're right by the side of the road. Sandy yeah. Russell forgot something. She goes by us two feet. Georgia screamed. She comes back from her house, does it again, and she's on the wrong side of the road. She goes, what is that? I said, I'm done. But I know, I know what happened. I, I, I'll tell you something. I, I, I mean, my youngest daughter was a cop in South Windsor and East Hartford. I sent one text to somebody there, a sergeant I knew, and I said, hey, Sarah wants to ride along. She worked for them for I don't know how many years. She got a law degree. She's state's attorney, not in Connecticut. In Connecticut. She she does she processes gun crimes. A major. Oh. Hey, nice to see you. Thank you. Um, but it's like I don't play games with this stuff. I'm pretty serious about what I do. I can see that. I, I, can see I am you're passionate about your. Oh. You know, you're complaining, you know. No. And I, I'm not offended by you trying to kick my ass. I get him, Mike. It's, it's, just, it's just your nature to let everybody know what's going on. Keep an eye on him. So don't be like him when you... Don't, don't be like him when you get to our age. I'm glad it wasn't my left knee because I just had that replaced. Mike, thanks. No, I'm supposed to get any. I won't do it. I'm too old. Hey. Thanks. Thank you, Have a nice night. You too. you too. Stop by. Call me Dave. I'm not Mr. Hill. That was my dad. I grew up in that house. That's why I'm there. We came back from when I graduated in 69. I went to college, right? And then I went to Connecticut for my career. And um, we had a choice to live. We had a house in Vermont, Connecticut, and, and my parents' house, which was empty. We moved back here because it's so gorgeous. I mean, I love it out there. But you guys stop by. I got... I'm serious. Half a million dollars worth of cars in that garage? Yeah, so you better keep an eye on it. <laughs> I, well, sometime, yeah, just stop by. Well, well, I'm always keeping an eye I'm always out there. So oh, yeah, well, just stop by. I mean, you're allowed. You're like, what's your first name? Colton. 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 Yes, sir. I mean, you guys are, that's fine. Don't call me sir. I hate that. It's like, I'm not old enough. And I know, but listen, you got class. You know, you're just, you're my equal. Keep it at that. You too. Hey, thanks. Stay out of trouble. Yeah. <laughs> I'll see you. Like I said, she's, you know, can be, you know, can be a, Hey, good, how are you? Cool, yeah, and dream. Whatever. Yeah, right. <laughs> hey, don't lie to me. <laughs> you're lying. Oh, you're too old for this shit. Uh, yeah, but you're still working, right? Yeah, you I, I, try to keep, I try to keep help. Yeah? yeah How's everything going? It's gone. It's yeah. Gone. You know. you, I, I take it you're not really where you want to be in your, in your quest for life. Well, I'm like retiring from my other, my other position, yeah. Which, yeah. which is nice, you know. Like, yeah. At least I know I have a pension. Excuse me, Jim. Yeah. Do I want to work at my age right now oh, that's at 54? I mean, I, I have to, but I don't want to. No, you know, I get it. No. I, there's, I actually got a job I never for, gone, you know, for a is. Section 9 I mean, I have two bone on bone uh, investigating agency. You know, which yeah. Yeah. would be and, basically all you do yeah, is do the investigation. I'm blocking everybody, hang on. Yeah. Um, you do the investigation yeah. and then uh, give the report. Yeah. You don't even make like a decision. I guess until they get you, you it's 250, uh, 250 bucks an hour. I'm like, sure. Really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I have to, I have. That's right. I started out with the AGs. This point, I think I'm not. That's the place to be. Yeah. I enjoy it. You know, yeah. I don't mind doing this. Yeah. You know, I. I She did. You know, you, you tell like it how it is. Yeah, you call it like you do it like it is. And hey, thank you again for what you are and do. Because I, well, like I, I said, I, I, I respect I think, you. I think I solved the issue with the, with the drive. She's still yeah. doing it. Well, then she just called me. Well, you know, you know, know the thing was, I'll give you a home, bro. I, I, and I got to be honest with you, I haven't because of the weather. Yeah, and our, you, well, you saw me. Our dog's blind. We push him to carry. Right, yeah. He gets cold now, so I can't. I wrap him and try to. Oh yeah, but, oh, yeah. but no, honestly, she's still doing it. It's just that I'm not on the road. If I was on the road, I'd lose, and I would call you. I'd ask for you because at least I know you'll respond. Thanks. <laughs> but it shouldn't happen. This, show, this whole thing shouldn't happen. It just shouldn't. And I get never put you in the middle of it because I told you I respect you. I would never cause you problems. Because people that have so class, really you treat that yeah. way. It's my whole yeah. life and career. <laughs> but the other thing is, don't make Dave mad because he just don't let go. <laughs> but anyhow, life is on. Hey, just, you know, like I said, I'm still doing my 
people. Doing my thing, you know. Yeah, you know, so. my thing yeah, when I I was what fifty. You know, we had to have I mean, 28 years and something. Now we had to be 59. Down. That's when I walked, but I, I lumped some of my pension the hell out of there. Yeah. Plus, I had a 401. Well, I'll get, I get, I'll get a life through pension. So yeah. I can't, you know, 25 years, that's a, that's a long time doing like that. I mean, yeah. 30 years altogether, you know. Yeah. Just, I'm tired. You know, I get, I just. I, well, I, I get that. I mean, I enjoy the work. I, I enjoy with the people. I, you know, that's my. my yeah, but you're a people person. Right. You know, I mean, look at the guys. I had like Wally. He used to stop by. We'd shoot the shit for an hour. That kind of guy. I mean, his father was a classy guy. I mean, you know, and it, 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 you know, like I said, there's, yeah, and we all have our issues. Yeah, well, we all have, I know that. We went to my boy's house. You know, yeah. so, I know, and, but. Hey, uh, it is, it is actually, thank you, you know, for being what yeah, you no are. Problem, I <laughs> no, I, listen, I told you that, and I said I would never disrespect you. People that, people that are that way deserve a lot more than they get. Because people will say, oh, you know, he like, doesn't like cops or something like that. <laughs> I love cops. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I just don't, I don't, some things I just, I don't get it. <laughs> but anyhow, when I, when I get back walking and everything, if there's a problem, I'll let you know and have you take care of it and stuff. But it was, honestly, I'll be doing a lot of, I'll, I'll doing a lot of the criminal investigations. Oh, good. I, do. I, I, you know, when I walk, I run into people walking. And honestly, I got a total of eight people says, oh my God, when I see her coming, we jump off the road. But there isn't always places you can jump off the road. I mean, I'm, I mean, you know I'm not making this shit up. Oh, everybody else, somebody else slows down. They like, it's, 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 it's not a big deal. As soon as the weather gets nicer, we're going to see what happens because she will slow down when she sees people. So, you know, you never know. You know, people, people react differently from yeah. different situations. Oh, I know. I, I get it. You know, it's just totally unnecessary. It's wasted yeah. motion. Well, I got to meet you, but you know, the rest of it's like wasted motion and, you know, yeah. it's time. But hey, it could be worse. Because some two bit drug dealer deal. comes into every other and you got to deal with that <laughs> I mean, freaking like shit. Well, I I know. I'm busier at my other time. Because we're kind of in the middle of the two urban areas, you know, the city. And, you know, well, well, the yeah, city so creeps. The transient population, they did like a normal, regular day, a weekday. You know, our transient population is 50,000, you know, so. But you know what the thing is, too? The creeping Section 8 piece of shit garbage that is never, ever, ever. <laughs> it's, it's the, it's the absentee yeah, animals is what right. it is. And, right. and I deal with that every day. You know, that's, you know, they, they, they don't oh care as long as they're getting their Section 8 money. Hmm. Yeah. Oh yeah, well we and, and that's it. It's like free ride, and uh, you know, every time it's like Camasset Village. That could be a full-time officer if you want to get out there. <laughs> we don't we don't say that word three times in a row. It's like Beetlejuice. Oh, oh yeah 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 yeah. Once is enough. No, I get it. I wasn't somebody was. Somebody was telling me a story. Somebody that knew somebody was telling me a story down there a few years back, and I said, "There's nothing doesn't go on down there." It's like, you know, I was actually yeah, I was down there on a daily basis. That and Pine Creek. Well, yeah, you know, let her hear. It was crazy. You wanted to stay away. Yeah. yeah. Ever since. Last place I want to be on a Saturday night. Oh well. And like I said, I do all Are you the, working uh, tonight or no? You just for this? Yeah, I just like, I oh. you know, same thing that, yeah. you know, all I was, the, at, I was at another board meeting prior to this and then. Oh, uh, yeah, well, hey. You know, once in a while, release. maybe in the middle of the night. <laughs> Always something. <laughs> hey, have a nice night, buddy. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, How are you? Hey, that's not true. What's that? Um, WJC has did a fine video on you, and um, from my understanding of constitutional law, that's a that's a six figure walk of shame. <laughs> well, hey, he grabbed my arm. What was that? What was that? I don't know. I asked him what his name and badge was. The cops said, "Make it do it the easy way. Let's do it the easy way, the hard way." I don't okay. know. I don't know. But here's the thing. It's all on video. Karen, I just said here in the back of the room. I can't believe we won't let these go out front. I'm disappointed. That, that, that's absolutely that's, 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 that's absolutely ridiculous. It's nuts. It's you know, nuts. And it's 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 it's, it's wrong. It's wrong.
it's a resolution. It's not a, okay, so that, so am I trespassed? Am I allowed to ever go back into the, what, what's the deal with that? I mean, I can, know. you know, I mean, so, um, you know, that's, I, you know, thank God you have a, you had a camera going too, so we actually got, Karen the, we went got in the, the back. Screen. Well, we got the live, so. WJAC has one. Um, she ran away from me as fast as possible. Dave Rejo goes, I said to him, I was like, yeah, I said, I'm going to sue this, I said, I'm going to sue this board, okay? As he's getting his car, he goes, real classy asshole, and I flipped him off, okay? Uh, I've asked Lamania for his name and badge number. Every time he's come out here to escort people out, he won't give it to me. I want to know what the cop, who the cop was that grabbed me by the arm. I, okay. well, they... wasn't wearing a name tag. No. They have to tell you. But but he didn't, so... Yeah, no, well, know. they are required. You know, we'll so. find out. Oh, I know, I know, but, but you know, you know that, that was... Well, it's out of control. And, okay, so, so, so let, let's get this straight, okay? Let's, let's, um, let's, get this all, let's get this all nailed down, okay? So what they did... I sat for the Pledge of Allegiance, okay, and I sat for the Pledge of Allegiance, the same reason Colin, Ka and, and Karen, if that upsets you, I apologize, but I'll explain to you why I do it, same reason Colin Kaepernick knelt you for You have a right to do that, John. Because, because it's, it, it, it's a symbol of, of showing, showing, protesting I police agree. brutality, spe specifically, okay. I didn't even kneel, I just sat, right. and, uh, and Ed Barzensky started going in on me, okay. I didn't, did I say that I had a body camera? No, I didn't say I had a body, I didn't say anything. This, could I be shooting, could I be shooting just audio? Yes, I could. I, I didn't answer any questions, you know, and I'm not obligated to, so. John, the First Amendment doesn't fly in up Rio or town. No, apparently it doesn't. I mean, but, <laughs> I, it, but I, it will, you know. Uh, it's going to. Um, uh, so this is a tobacco-free facility. Our, your illustrious chief was out back smoking a cigarette. Oh, does he smoke? Yeah, he's smoking a cigarette, so I, I you know I, I gotta talk to you later anyhow. Yeah.